None of the world's economic systems, socialism, communism, fascism, or the free enterprise system have eliminated the problems of elitism, nationalism, racism, and most of all, scarcity. I spent so many years improving area by area. I said, look, the whole society is aberrated the way we do things. Why not redesign society? It'd be easier than making all these thousands of products. So you really decided to, do, to, to redesign the culture? Because I couldn't get... I, patchwork didn't work. It wasn't sufficient. So they thought I was a communist. You know, after all, the guy wanted to redesign society. What else? Communism has social stratification. Communism has banks and money. Communism has armies and navies. Communism has a government. We have none of those things. Communism is also interested in the labor class. We are too, but we want to eliminate the labor as soon as possible and automate using the best of science and technology. They never really had a plan or a method. The communist did not. Communism isn't radical enough for this age. It was great a couple of hundred years ago, maybe, but it doesn't. It's too old-fashioned a method based on opinions rather than technology. Okay. Okay. Socialism along with it, too old-fashioned and not enough detail of what to do about it. Socialists never came up with how transportation would be designed, how schools would be designed, how to change human values, no detail. So it was the beginning, but it always became corrupt. Socialism and communism became corrupt because it's subject to those things.